And thanks for joining us tonight. I'm Eugene Daniel. Tonight, Erica Harold and Kwame Raoul spoke to voters about why they deserve your vote in November. Delon Dillard joins us from the newsroom after attending that event. Delon, what can you tell us? Well, Eugene, both candidates wanted to meet voters right here in central Illinois face to face. Now, Erica Harold, speaking first, stressed the fact that she wants to be the state's watchdog. She spoke on her desire to focus on workers' comp and fighting against controversy in Springfield. Now, the attorney called it an asset that she's never held in elected office. She wants voters to know that she won't be swayed by any special interests from either parties. The attorney general should be given the power by the General Assembly to be able to convene a statewide grand jury. And that's important because it would give you the opportunity to be far more proactive and aggressive in investigating corruption. Now, Harold's opponent, Kwame Raul, was also there to speak with voters. He focused his part of the evening on what he calls Harold's lack of experience, saying she shouldn't be able to make any promises because she knows nothing about. Take a listen. On all of these issues that she says she wants to advocate for now, she's never weighed in like people do on a day to day basis in Springfield. People come from all over the state who are concerned about the policy uh, that we are putting forth. She hasn't been down there doing that. The senator touched on other topics as well. He stressed his desire to not only invest in education, but agricultural education as well. He believes that investing in residents will keep them right here in the state. He also spoke to farmers and he said he wants them to know that he's fighting for them and will approach all issues based on the facts. Now, one topic that they both agreed on is a possible televised debate. They both confirmed that that's something that could happen in October. Eugene. All right, Delon. Tonight